Hello and welcome to my video. Desktop, overhead, LED ring light with a cell phone mount bracket and stand. This desktop, overhead, LED ring light with cell phone mount and stand by Ulanzi is perfect for filming products from an overhead view or at an upright straight into the camera view. Perfect for filming, live streaming, or photographing selfies or products. This desktop overhead ring light set and cell phone mount stand is portable. You will need to assemble this light kit together. So let's take a look at all the parts inside the box. I will talk about the parts and show you the parts and then I will assemble the light kit together. Inside the box comes the instructions of how to put it together, the Yuanzi light kit, and then you have it in different languages. So we're going to look at this one here. Inside the box there is the support rod with a crossbar. The this rod goes up and down. This is the support. Now this is the crossbar, which you will put the phone here, and then you can lock down the angle of the phone with this crossbar and then this is the support bar where the light will go up here and then this is where you tighten the height of the light from the base. You just screw that in and that tightens the support bar in the height from the table to the light. Next we have a phone clip which you will pull this open and you will put your phone in here and then this will assemble onto this rotating knob here. And that's where your phone will go with this phone clip. There is a USB power supply cord which you will need to purchase separately a power supply travel adapter which is this. Now this is something that I'm providing this does not come with it, but you can buy these for a few dollars. Or you can plug this into your computer to get power. Or you plug this into the power adapter, just like this, and then put this into a socket. The ring light adjusting knob, which allows the ring light to be adjusted to any angle. Then inside the box is the actual light. The light is packed upside down. The ring light is plastic. Then you have the buttons. You have your power button. Your illumination button if you want Plus, I think it goes up to 10 different illumination settings, and then you can minus your illuminations. And then I think you have a timer, and then I'm not sure what this is yet. Okay, then on the side here, you have your knob to when you rotate the ring light downward. If you're filming down here, the light will illuminate your product or your subject and you can rotate the light to where you are filming directly into the camera. You set your angle, then you tighten this knob so the light will not rotate anymore. It was set it in a fixed position and this is where the support pole will go for the light and then here is where this knob will go to tighten it onto the actual support pole. 
in the middle of the light here, you can put an adapter mount and then your cell phone as well here if you don't want your cell phone on the crossbar. Last inside the bag is the base, which is pretty heavy. There is rubber on the bottom so it does not skid or move on the table or scratch the table. On this side, you will see the name, Yolanzi. This is pretty heavy. This is metal. It's pretty heavy. And then this is where the support bar will screw into the base. So now I'm going to assemble all the parts together. So the first thing I'm going to do, I'm just going to set the base right there. Just going to put the support rod on the screw and then turn the support rod until it tightens. Now I'm going to put the foam mount bracket onto the crossbar right here. So now I'm going to take the foam mount bracket, take off this plastic bolt, then I'm going to take the crossbar, which I've tightened right there to hold the crossbar on the support pole, then I'm going to take the bolt, the plastic bolt, and put on the crossbar right there, take the foam mount bracket and kind of just snap onto the ball. Then I'm going to tighten with the plastic bolt. Now this is plastic. The mount is plastic and the bolt is plastic, but this is metal. Um, this is plastic. And then the pole is metal and the base is metal. Now I'm going to place the plastic LED ring light on the support bar, just like this. Then I'm going to tighten down the knob and that will tighten it to the support bar. So now the light is attached to the support bar. The crossbar is on. The phone mount is on and it's all connected to the base. So the assembly is now complete. Right here is where you plug in the USB power cord. Then you take this end and plug into the power adapter or your computer. So I'm going to do that now. So I'm going to plug this into my power adapter and then plug this into the wall socket. When you plug in the USB cord and there is power. There is a little ring light that lights up right here to let you know that this thing has power. Right in the center is the power switch. Over here is a timer if you want to set the timer and then photograph or start videoing. And then over here is color temperature adjustment button. And then this is light illumination down, and this is increased light illumination. So here's the plus for full illumination, and then the minus. So let's aim it at this curtain and watch the illumination. I'm going to go negative two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So there's ten modes. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Next, I'm going to clip my cell phone onto the cell phone mount. Take my phone and just pull this mount out here. And it clips on. Just like that. So my phone is on the mount. I can push the crossbar out and then angle it down, or I can pull it all the way in and angle the phone completely downward, just like that. Then I can take the light, sit this, unscrew the little knob there, 
and then rotate the light down towards my product down here as well as the phone. Also, if you're going to film straight into the camera, if you want to do a live stream where you're talking to somebody, you just set the phone straight forward, then you rotate the light upward, lock down your knobs. So if you want to film, if you want to film just sitting in front of the camera, the light will illuminate your face and then the camera will be filming you or you can do selfies. Let's look at the rotations of the phone, the crossbar, and the light. So the light can go all the way down. The light can rotate down to here or all the way up here. You can bounce the light from the ceiling or onto something else. You can rotate the light around this way. Then the crossbar moves in, moves all the way out, and you can lock it down for fixed position. And then you can pull it in and then lock it down for a fixed position. You can rotate the entire crossbar, or you can rotate the phone down like that. And then also, the phone will rotate completely like that. There's a lot of rotation. The, the rotation knob moves, the phone, you can cr turn the crossbar for the phone, rotate just like that to get the perfect angle that you need, and the crossbar can move down the support pole. So if you're looking for a desktop overhead ring light, and video kit. This is perfect, again, for photographing products, doing selfies, live streaming, and making videos. This desktop overhead LED ring light with cell phone mount stand allows you to position your cell phone angle and the ring light angle independently over your product or subject, which you are filming or photographing. The light and the phone support rod can be adjusted independently. You can tilt both independently and rotate the cell phone support arm 360 degrees. This overhead desktop phone mount with LED light is great for filming food preparation videos, filming product videos, drawing videos, crafting videos, or for upright selfie videos, or upright selfie photographs, or live streaming videos. The cost of this light and cell phone kit is around $50 to $55 on Amazon. I do hope you liked this video, and again, thanks for watching.